Hi Air Signs, welcome to my channel and today we are doing a special read it's because it's a month of love and I've been requested to do some special love readings. So I start today with the singles. If you are an air sign, star sign with uh, Gemini, Libra or Aquarius, that means an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, rising, sun, moon, Jupiter or Venus, then this reading is for you if you are single, if you are if you just had a breakup or you've been single for long. So why are you single and what is the message for you in this month of love? And the world is celebrating love. Why are my air signs single? So let's see. Let's see. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. What is happening? Happy birthday, Aquarians. Those who are celebrating their birthday this week or this month. Though by Vedic sidereal, the Aquarius season starts from the 15th of the month as the sun shifts to Aquarius. So right now, as for Vedic, we're still having the Capricorn season. But for a tropical, the birthdays, I mean, the people who have the birthday right now are Aquarius. Okay? All right. So let's see. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. What is happening with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius? Why are they still single? Gemini, oh my God, Libra, Aquarius, let's see the common energies for all the air signs, all right, air signs, firstly, I feel your relationship, your past relationship, or your situation, it's been ongoing. It's, it's been like you're stuck in this for a long time now. And you're holding strong. You're not giving up. You're like, I'll wait some more. But could be in your past relationship, what was lacking was teamwork. What was lacking was respect. So, for you, respect is very important. For you, the person has to be very patient because you are an impatient sign, especially Gemini, you. Or Aquarius, even you. You're an impatient sign. So, you want some stability. You want a person in your life who could bring that stability and that be patient with you. Also, you want somebody or... You are thinking of somebody, this time you want someone in your life who can think differently, who doesn't have the typical thought process because that's that's the thought process. The thought process that you see around people is not something that interests you anymore. You've seen it all and you don't want that. You want somebody very different. Somebody who respects you, who is ready to work with you, who is ready to help you grow and with whom you can grow. So maybe in your past relationship, it was a stuck kind of relationship. There was lack of respect. There was lack of teamwork. Also with the strength there, maybe the other person was, uh, you know, somebody who was very controlling, didn't have the patience to handle you. That could be, or you are the one who is in this mode right now. You would rather wait. It's been a long time you waiting, but you would rather wait than to compromise. You want quality relationship, not quantity. That is what is happening with you, air signs. Now, Gemini, when we come to you, look at you. You have had the tower with the devil and the knight of suits. So, it looks like things just abruptly ended between you two. It definitely was a toxic relationship. Whatever relationship you were in, one of you was the terminating factor and the other person kind of cut it out, came out of it. It was difficult. It was a very difficult. It took a lot of your mind space. One of you could have been very materialistic. So there has been a tar moment. It was an abrupt ending. It had to end and it just ended because one of you claimed your right you started questioning. 
you started asking you started questioning the intent of the person the relationship or there was too much of mind games somebody was controlling the other person till the other person took part so there was a lot of fear there was a lot of thoughts about i cannot leave the other person though you wanted to or the other person wanted but there was a lot of fear attached to the relationship it's going to hamper this it's going to stop this it's going to uh, you know be this it it can go bad this is where things can go wrong so such kind of negative thoughts were there and also i see somebody losing patience maybe you are the one who lost patience because the night of swords this this could be you you lost patience because the person was very controlling whoever you were in a relationship with they wanted complete control till you could wait no longer and this broke and you moved if you have been single for long this is how your last relationship has ended and if you have never been in a relationship then maybe it is because of the fear of your mind or your focus on materialistic things maybe for you right now the focus is job money things that you want to achieve in life and you want to really achieve them go ahead get those things in your life and something happen there so you're not really thinking of relationships and if you just came out of a relationship this could be the re- this could be the reason toxicity there was a lot of toxicity it had to break you knew it had to break it just broke okay though you were being patient in the relationship but i think your patience gave away and it broke because there was some verbal spat libra coming to you look at you if you have been single you will not be single anymore because you understand love you understand the vibration of love you understand you need somebody in your life you need you definitely you in your you your definition of love is very clear in your mind there is no two way you are taking initiatives not that you're not like gemini you're not scared you're not thinking of materialistic things you're not thinking of you know proving your point you have waited long you have been holding strong but now you feel you are ready with your cup of love there could be a new love coming towards you or people approaching you with offers of love so if you are dating you will find exceptional luck working in your favor people could be talking they could be flirting they could be flirtatious with their message and you will have a lot of messages a lot of things happening a lot of options a lot of people a lot of communication regarding love regarding relationship coming towards you and you understand them all you understand the feeling of love you understand you know how to filter which one is genuine love and which one is lust you know how to feel it because you definitely are seeking love and you are ready to offer your cup of love provided the cup coming towards you is full of love so you are ready librans you are ready for a relationship whether you had a breakup in the past or whether you are Uh, you have been always single doesn't matter there is a new love coming your way with the ace of cups aquarius coming to you looks like you haven't given up hope of a relationship two cards telling me that you're still waiting you're still hoping there's a two of swords and the star both give me the same vibration of i've healed I know I deserve somebody I'm waiting for that right person to come in my life There could be somebody coming in your life but or there is somebody in your life who is in and out you're not sure whether to consider them a lover or consider them a friend you don't know how to define them and definitely you're not choosing them that's for sure with the two of swords you would choose something better you have options or you're waiting for a better option but you haven't given up hope which is good you're not thinking that no nah, i i do not deserve love or nobody will come to us me i'm going to stay single die single you don't have that mentality 
But at the same time, whoever is coming, there could be somebody rushing in towards you, but somewhere you feel they are not very trustworthy. They are there because, you know, because they want to be there and the moment they want to move out, or, or this could also mean a short stint, a one-night stand, a moment of passion, you know, somebody coming towards you with a moment of passion, but they can be gone too. There's no commitment. Okay? So this is what is uh, kind of making you wait further for the right person because whoever is there in your life as a friend or as a friend with benefit or a temporary relationship, you have not yet decided on them. You don't feel the love towards them. You would rather wait. You're keeping your options open. You would rather wait for somebody to come towards you. Now, let's see some oracles. Let's pull some oracles and see what the energy is. But Aquarians, you definitely are hopeful. Libra, you have beautiful energy. And Gemini, just let this time settle in because I think you just came out of a toxic relationship. All right, so... Let's pull some oracles and see what messages we can pull for you guys. That's for my air signs. What message do they need to have? Air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Gemini, you have the Emperor. Libra, you have the High Priestess. And you have the Hangman, Aquarius. You're still waiting in the limbo, not moving. All right, Gemini, you have the emperor, so choose wisely. Choose wisely. Don't make a decision because you're forced to make a decision. You are waiting for the right relationship. Or that you could find success around the Aries season. Around March is when you can look for, you know, some, some success in your relationship. But definitely you're looking at Financial security, you're looking at uh, emotional security. You're looking, you are going to evaluate relationships from the mind space and not from the heart space. Okay, so this could be you or whoever is coming towards you. You're going to judge them with that kind of vibration. Libra, you are being very intuitive. It's like you know who is coming with what. Queen of Cups with the High Priestess, similar kind of energy, Cancer Pisces energy of being very intuitive. You know it all. You understand everything. You know the secret. You know why the people are doing this, who is saying what and what they mean. But hold on. You will know. You know the secrets. You know who is hiding what, whose intention is what. So be Trust your intuition, Libra. Just trust your intuition. And Aquarius, don't, you might feel a bit stuck because of this person who keeps coming in and out of your life. But give it some time. Either you change the way you think, because that's here, that's here, the hangman has come twice. So either you change the way you think or be ready to be stuck like this for some time, at least till the Pisces season. Maybe you're not able to make a decision because you don't know whether they're right or wrong for you. You're not giving up hope. But you kind of feel stuck in the limbo and the cards say, hold on, hold on, wait. Or maybe try to see the situation from a different way. Maybe this person is not right for you. That's what the universe is trying to show you. So you got to be patient and you got to wait for some more time. Libra, trust your intuition. And Gemini, Yes, you want power, you want to make a wise decision, and this time you're very rational, stick with it, okay? All right, air signs, this was your special love reading. If you are single and if you are not dating anybody or just out of a relationship, this is how your love looks like, and this is the reason why you're still single, and this could be what is coming towards you. Hope you liked it. If you like this reading, please hit the like button, share it, subscribe to my channel if you're new. And I'll see you around. Bye.